Hey guys, uh, let's learn about a uh, btool command. What are the uses of uh, btool command? So there are a couple, couple of points that which I mentioned here. We can uh, look at all of these scenarios in this particular video. I hope you all know how uh, how and why btool command is used and what is the importance of the btool command. We try and have some uh, demo here. Uh, basically, it is uh, you know while writing the command, this is how you start. Uh, Splunk bin folder. I mean, opt is the place where you are, uh, you know, going to do the troubleshoot for the uh, btool command. Different scenarios, like in the configuration file, or uh, you know, based on the particular app, you will be uh, doing the, you know, the troubleshooting using btool. In this case, if I write command, okay, uh, Splunk cmd btool. All right, btool is the command, and uh, at the same time, along with the btool command, uh, if I mention the uh, configuration file transforms tra transforms and list i get this uh, i mean this is the result uh, which i'll be getting you know as far as the uh, transforms configuration is concerned all right now uh, let me differentiate i mean let me show you one more uh, scenario uh, as far as the uh, app you know uh, we also do troubleshooting using b tool command for the you know uh, app specific app okay so in this case, let's say I have any uh, you know particular app. Uh, maybe I can have an app name as search or something. So what I do, I write uh, the same sort of command cmdb tool and hyphen hyphen app. There you go. Uh, if I say searching is the app, okay. So I will uh, go and uh, you know mention the particular configuration file which is transforms. I have to give list as per the process. So I get this result and this is the uh, you know scenario where you are uh, checking you are doing the troubleshooting using B tool in the specific app particular app with the configuration file uh, in this case you know it will be transforms all right so if I uh, show you you know similar sort of a scenario with a very small difference okay if I do not have this hyphen app and all that if I just have only that specific app and the configuration file how the result will be all right so uh, i'm going to write i'm going to do that now there you go uh, so let me delete this i just have b2 and transforms list what is the result i get here because i'm just checking only list and debugging it now all right i have to write i have to give uh, debug here there you go i get entire result like this so this is the main scenario where you can give the uh, i go i hope you got the difference so one small uh, thing i just you know uh, give you one more uh, scenario which is very very easy just check it okay maybe it is not uh, you know comparatively uh, equal to these two scenarios but uh, here if i just check what is the result i'm gonna get i'm just show you uh, with the b tool command okay if i check the particular app and the configuration file what do i get this is what b tool check if i just check all right, you can do uh, this scenario as well. Now let's see. Uh, this is what the brief, uh, you know, I have for you in this video. Uh, let's understand what we learn. We spoke about, uh, I mean, the configuration files gone almost every aspect Splunk. What do you uh, do in the GUI edits? You know, the configuration files. We have uh, we have checked that. And uh, apart from this, what we also learn is, uh, uh, you know, the configuration configuration file or uh, any kind of B tool command. We also I mean, one more important uh, important point you have to remember: don't touch a default folder anytime. Okay, no matter uh, what happens. Okay, so you need to be very very careful in this scenario. Friends, that's all I have in this video. We'll see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.